This is the Aerofoam L39 from Banana Hobby. This jet has the JP fan installed versus the Chain Sun 105 millimeter. And I did everything according to Rich Baker's uh, build. And so this is going to see what we got here. So it's gonna be it. fine. Let's just get it done. I'm ready. How's it feel? All trimmed up? Yeah, I'm, I'm uh, got a little nose. Two a little nose heavy. Can she uh, put the battery a little forward to this flight? Yeah, I noticed that on takeoff is a little bit long. Yeah. Looks good. Looks like it's tracking good. Yeah, it is. I want to get the uh, gyro turned on right now. Track is coming around. Keep it high. Landing. Nice. That's how I would have done it. And that was the brakes? Yeah. Which that was nice. So, JP fan, on grass, amazing. Gyro is the Cortex Gyro, fully initialized. There you have it, guys. JP fan, and I never got really over three quarter throttle. Nah, you're time. just cruising. So let's turn turn her around, bring her back. All right. Timer start. Third right, next turn left. Yeah, I like that brake action. That's awesome. No, I just got to remember how I got it. You got it on a dial? Yeah. That's why. We had speed brakes out too. That got the whistle in it? Damn. That's just the fan? Wow, sounds good. All right, so with that being said, we're gonna get the battery checker and check the battery. Now, with the taxi, that is 30 seconds over 
three minute flight time that I had on the radio. So let me get the checker real quick. Check the checker. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's pretty right there. That's right up the tailpipe, no doubt about it. Clean, too. That's sexy. That's an Iron Man fan. That's an Iron Man. Okay, so basically I also think, too, that I did put the battery a little far forward for the uh, basically getting her made and dialed all in like I wanted to. Yep. Um, so I can move it back probably a quarter of an inch because I, I went to the air of caution. Are oh, you running the 62s or the 52s? These are the 6200s. Okay. So um, let's see where our throttle cut, canopy here. All right, so let's check the pack. Guys, you can see what we got, got going on here. I have this, like I said, this is my original mark. I've got it about a half an inch forward, about a finger width. I'm gonna move it back for the uh, Yeah, better safe than sorry on your original takeoff and yeah. get it set up, initialize. Um, Let's see here. So let's get this down in here. All right, there you go, Wayne. Look. <laughs> Which way? Am I upside down? Yeah, there you go. Look at that. Hold on a second. We have, man, 385s practically across the board. I mean, and, and, nice. and that was great flight, guys. Very efficient. Um, another thing, guys, I want you to notice in this plane is the, the neatness of everything. Um, I've got my life pack up here to run the gear, the servos. Um, notice this is all neat and clean with carbon. Ooh, um, carbon. The uh, Cortex gyro sits up here. None of this comes in as plain. I did all this to modification to make it look nice and tidy. Looks like elf on a shelf. So, uh, yeah. Looks good. And also, we kept the big connectors coming out of here, guys, as you can see. Yeah, those are 8mm, right? Yeah, which I think are critical for this airplane. Oh, you got to have it. So, Keeps the um, heat down. Yeah. Because these batteries are not even hardly warm, so long. No, they're not very warm. I mean, so yeah, I think that was an incredible flight. Landing's good, takeoff was good, circuits. Yeah. Let's charge up and do it again. Let's do it again. All right. Let's go. All right, guys, so Banana Hobby. That's right. Another home run, so we'll see you in the next one. Well, there it is, guys. Thanks to Banana Hobby for making this happen, and Carrie with her awesome customer support. What a fantastic flying jet. Can't say enough great things about it down to the JP fan that I installed in this thing, guys. It flew amazing. Banana Hobby knocked this one out of the park. And don't forget, check us out every Tuesday night at 8.30 Eastern for Flight Club, where we'll be talking about this awesome flight tonight. And guys, there's a jet out there for everyone's like. You can look at the Breitling scheme that I have, or you can also look at the Czech scheme, there's a German scheme and an Arctic camo scheme, guys. They're all extremely beautiful, all fly great, and you can get you one a day and add it to your hangar. You will not be disappointed. Banana Hobby is coming out with some awesome things. Also, thanks to Mr. Rich Baker, RC Informer, for helping me with this build, installing the fan, and getting this jet exactly like I wanted it set up, just like the one he did on his video. Again, guys, check out bananahobby.com. Get your L39, and you'll thank me all the way to the field. I'm Jeff. You're watching Jeff's Custom RC, and we'll see you next time.